Wow, guys. Okay, so Steve here, Command Center Wargaming. I'm back here with another video because I just got back and finally I have a box from Forge World. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's them. Finally, my Hydra Elite, or I'm hoping what is my Hydra Elite, has arrived. It's either that or it's my paints from uh, from Green Stuff World. I'm pretty sure that's that's a that's a Forge World box though. Sounds like it, Royal Air Mail. All right, so finally we can start this project. Like, so I'm, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit concerned still about those Green Stuff World paints. Um, it's been nearly a month now, and guys, it doesn't take that long to get something from England, um, even on this crappy island where I am. Okay, but uh, like this came in about two weeks, so yeah, I'm getting a bit concerned. I, I might chase them up if it doesn't come by the end of the week. I'll, I'll chase it up. But uh, but what it means is we could actually start this project. Right, which is absolutely fantastic because I really want to do this. Like I've, I've got this vision set up for this Hydra Elite Alpha Legion uh, project, and like I, I don't want to go through and um, and just be like, you know, sort of like having to start something else and then just coming back to this. So, you know, we can assemble these now. We can do the basing now and all that kind of stuff. We can even undercoat them right while we're waiting for the other stuff to arrive. All right, I'm really excited about this, everybody. Um, so hopefully, uh, it is what it is. And uh, we'll do an unboxing here on the channel right here, right now. All right, so, um, all right, fantastic, everybody. Thanks so much, and uh, let's go unbox these Hydra Elite. Hopefully, that's what they are. Um, fantastic, all right. All right, everybody, we're back again. I got my Steve's cam on this time. So um, we're gonna see how this how this works. I'm just gonna lower it a little bit here, just so I can hopefully this is see what I'm seeing here. And we're just working on the other end of the of the table um, now. Uh, Hydra Elite. I'm sure this will be them. So we're just gonna unbox them and uh, just have a look inside and just see what's going on. I've been waiting for these for ages. I might even start doing some assembly um, a little bit later as well. Uh, we, you know, which would be awesome. So I just need to grab my unboxing tool. That's why I just use my hand this time. So let's have a look here. Just unbox that. Pull this off. Yeah, rip. Okay, so what do we got? What do we got? Yeah, it's definitely a Hydra Elite. I can't look at that because I got my dress on it. <laughs> there we go. So there's the um, there's a commander right over here. So I think it's the commander anyway. Yeah, so Alpha Legion Praetor in Cataphracty Terminator armor. So he's gonna look he's gonna look awesome. Right, um, here we have some air. Some Forge World, I think this is just the normal Terminators. Yeah, so these are the, these are just the normal Terminators. Alright, got the special weapons here and everything. Really nice, really nice kiss, kits those. Alright. Really fantastic there. We'll, we'll open all this up and, and we'll have a look. So, it's wonderful. In here we have the bases. Right, so just standard like 30 mil Terminator bases, I think. Nice instruction manual. Like if the, if the paint doesn't come, I'll just, I'm just gonna work with a different scheme with them, but I really wanted these guys to be awesome. My little authenticity document from Forge World. And, um, here we go, resin components, just a checklist, bit of instruction manual, not much to it, uh, assembly of these guys. So, what else can be in here, because I'm pretty sure that's it, like, yeah, okay, so a Christmas, a Christmas gift voucher book, um, which I believe we've already got, already gone through on the channel, alright, and, uh, and that's it, the rest is just... 
the rest is just packaging and air. So, you know, that's that's okay. That's it's, it's all good. So, let's take a look here. So we've got the bases. There's four, it's five bases. That's good, right? So I should have. Oh, there's another base here for my for my creator. You know, so the the idea with these guys, the idea with this Alpha Legion is, is basically, you know, I want to come in, deep strike them down on the board, turn two, have like a like a sorcerer with them, maybe a Terminator Lord, you know, see what happens. Have have like a sorcerer with them, and then and then literally like um, uh, like like they come down, overcharge. They, they all got plasma weapons. They overcharge their plasma. And they literally just wreck vehicles. And then you've got, because they're Alpha Legion, they're minus one to hit, providing the the, uh, the chapter approved still stands the way it should. And they're Alpha Legion, so they got minus one to hit. So they're even tougher to kill Terminators. And um, you know, you tight you cast warp time and prescience on them as well. So that's that's pretty much like my my tactic, you know, for this. And, you know, as I was saying before on the channel, I've got like a few, a few little things I want to be doing with them. So I've, I've got these, kind of like this, um, you know, so these red Martian rock, soil rocks. And uh, I've got some soil effects up here. All right. I've got the water effects uh, somewhere around here. I packed it away. I'll just get it out. They're here somewhere. And, um, and then I've got like some other ideas on how we can get it looking really good. And, the idea, the idea for the Alpha Legion was that uh, my my um, my Hydra Elite was that they were going to have these really, really, really nice sort of like like if you can imagine like a like a swamp on Mars. So you've got like these red rocks, this red sort of marsh here, maybe some crazy like you know pink grass or something or purple grass. It's going to contrast really well with this with this pattern here. Um, you know, so it's 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 really good and. And like I said, I'm just I'm just waiting now from the for the green stuff world for the color shifting paint. But um, you know, all good. Like I mean, I, I could get started without them now. It's not mandatory that I have that I have those now. So that's it's not a big drama, you know. So uh, all right, let's have a look uh, at what we got here. So I don't think I'm going to open this guy just yet because I want to keep it together. All right, and um, here we can see we've got the body. There's a plasma gun. There's this awesome head. Very nice detail on these models. All right, and um, and these are the these are the actual Terminators themselves. So I will I will just open this and um, we'll have a look at it. Make sure that we're uh, everything's in here. Everything is good. Because we need, we need it to be in here. We need it to be good. All right, so here we go. Here are the, this looks like some of the arms, beautiful scaling here on the shoulder pads, right? Like very lovely, it's this nice reptile kind of like, you know, pattern here on the, on the, uh, on the screw, on the model. Again, there's the other side of the arm, right? So it's, uh, I believe it's uh, cataphracty armor. Yes, it is cataphracty. Right, more more arms. I think you've got some options here. Right, I'm not sure about their rules. You have to look up their rules. Um, here are their here are their helmets. Really cool, like little helmets there. We actually get five of them, so it looks like we get one extra in the kit, which is really cool. Uh, we have the this weapon. I don't know what this weapon is. I'll have to look it up. But like I said, I'm I'm happy. To, it looks like some kind of like gravity beam or something or graviton beam or like sound thing it's got like a little radar dish on the top uh, but we'll have to look it up see how it goes uh, shoulder pads right shoulder pads are here okay so just line all these up and I'll just I'll just put this one down here so all right so maybe you can see a little bit better the the bodies right got the bodies here Alright, so it looks like they're all one piece, which uh, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. It's a little less assembly, which is fine. 
Um, I really like how they're on these things. You could sort of like have the option to like hold them up, you know. Um, some more shoulder pads here, right, with that scale reptilian sort of stuff, right, which is really cool. And uh, here we got the uh, here we got more plasma guns. This is this is what my guys are getting. My guys are getting plasma guns, and they're gonna get they're gonna get plasma guns in one hand, and uh, and a small plasma gun, and then they're gonna get these brutal epic axes. Look at those axes. Check that out. They're gonna get these brutal axes in the um, in the other hand. So you imagine these guys like coming in. Uh, on the on the battlefield, term two, deep striking in, uh, accompanied by a sorcerer in Terminator armor, uh, or a sorcerer lord, and then literally just coming in. Maybe you've got like a well, we've got the Terminator commander here, right? And then and then literally uh, coming in, deep striking like thirteen away from some vehicles, um, you know, and and literally like just all of them just firing like their overcharged plasma weapons uh, into the uh, into the enemy. Yeah, I reckon you could easily uh, out like alpha strike a tank with that, you know, and um, you know, and and then uh, you know, basically after that, you know, get him in on the charge, you know. So it's um, it's pretty brutal. It's pretty brutal, and I think they're they're going to be awesome. And uh, I'm hoping that with chapter approved, uh, like the, I'm going to do another video later. There's been some been some leaks about like uh, more rumors about chapter approved, some more points and. They're basically saying like Terminators are like half cost now, which is nuts. So if that's true, then they're going to have to reduce them for the Chaos Terminators as well. Um, and then, you know, it's going to be awesome. But just, just so that you know, these, um, these guys here, they're actually, they're actually just uh, substituting... Uh, they're 30k models, but I, I want to use them as a substitute in um, 40k for Alpha Legion. So... You know, I think I think that'll work quite nicely. So just to be careful, I don't want to start busting sprues. But um, yeah, so should be good. Should be really good, everybody. Really awesome. I'm really excited. I'm really excited to like to to have these and uh, and to be assembling these now. So. Um, it's gonna be it's gonna be epic, and uh, you know what? I, I might even start on them now, guys. I might even start assembling them now. Screw it. Um, I've, I've waited like weeks, you know, for these guys, and you know, and I'm just waiting on the paint now. But it's kind of just like, you know, whatever. So, all right, everybody, cool. Wrap the video up there. Subscribe if you want. Um, you know, we post Warhammer content uh, regularly, and uh, click the little bell o a notification there on the side. That'd be awesome, super fantastic. We do lots of things. And uh, I'll see you in the next video, everybody. This is Project One Alpha Legion. Fantastic.